it was a scrappy game. It was a loose game, and I think um, a difficult side to, to break down. A London Welsh. They uh, they don't really always go by the script. Uh, they've got a big heavy pack. Um, they put you under pressure, and they like to pl play some rugby. They like to offload, and and sometimes that can catch you out. And uh, yeah, it was it, it was disappointing that we gave them an interception try because that sort of kept the scores um, a little bit too close for our, for our liking. But it was pleased that we got the four tries and, and got the bonus point. That interception try we worked out was their fourth in ten games here. Is that um, you know something that you'd planned for during the week? Yeah, they, they defend with a lot of line speed and they come in and put a lot of pressure on you and uh, I guess that sometimes has its benefits like the penalty try but also then it, it, um, it can have problems and uh, if you actually go through a few phases they can't get the line speed and then they end up losing numbers and then you can score and I think we saw on a couple of occasions that happening. Well, that was to the fore in the second try for Tom May's second, which was an absolute fantastic score. How, how much did you need that going into half time? Yeah, I think that's very important. I think, uh, you know, we had a solid start, interception put us behind, we came back, got the first try, and then I think you know, from, it was from a restart, which was really good. I think uh, Samu Manoa broke out, Ken Peasley up that right touch line, and then some good little interpassing to see uh, Tommy May go uh, close to under the posts. So, uh, really good to score just before that, the half time. A, a lot of credit, you know, they were battling, and at one stage, Stage, um, we put, uh, we're still under pressure. I think we, you know we were 10 points ahead, but we'd gone down to 14 men. Um, you know, still a, 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 a little ill-disciplined by us. And of course, they're, they're fighting, and, and I think they'll do that to, all the way towards the end of the season. Ultimately, we wanted to get the bonus point win. We knew what we had to do, and we knew that London Welsh were fighting for their lives, aren't they? We obviously sailed picking up that win. Um, so yeah, it was very, very uh, massive, massive turning point in our sort of last last obviously quarter of the season to to push on now. So you're playing along with uh, several Saints players who, who played in the relegation and in the relegation year a few years ago and you know you've been involved with a few scraps with Leeds yourself as well so did you was, was there kind of a lot of know-how in the Saints dressing room as to how Welsh were going to come approach today's game? Yeah, yeah, there was. Obviously, we built up the week knowing that they're going to come out, come out of the blocks and they're going to they're going to fight for everything they've got. And they showed that up until the last last 30 seconds of the game, where they're, they're running the ball from their 22. And you know, we're thinking flipping out the game, the game's over. You know, just get the ball off. But you know, they just showed that they're in it for the long run. They want to keep playing and they want to put us under pressure. They're not just going to lie down and let teams, you know, ball over them. That said, now it takes the pressure off sale next week. We're just going to want to come down and, you know, probably play quite a bit of rugby like they did on Friday night. You know, how much, do, you know, how much pressure does that now put Saints under next week to to get another another win to try and secure the place in the top four? Yeah, it does put us under a little bit of pressure, but I think now we've got a bit of momentum. Like I said, it was it's good to come back from that win, you know, from that from that loss, sorry, that we suffered against Leicester, and obviously get back on the horse now. And if Sale come down here, want to chuck the ball about, that'll suit us on our defensive policy. We'll you know we'll hit them and we'll force turnovers, and like I say, hopefully we'll get another four or five tries and seal another bonus point for us to push on again. On paper, with Saints being a top four team coming to Welsh, who were twelfth at the start of the day, you know, people might have thought. That it would, you know, the result was in the bag already. But you know, today's performance, and particularly Welsh's performance, really didn't show that, did it? No. And you know, Dylan and uh, Dowse and Woody, these lads, like the international boys that have played against these teams for a long time, sort of said, "Do not underestimate this team. We've got to have respect for everyone in the Premiership now. There's no easy team. There's no easy place to go and play. So for us, it was about." Obviously, getting our exit right, getting our strategy right, and sticking to the game plan, and not getting drawn into to their sort of scrappy, scrappy rug play, and obviously focusing on what on what we want to do.